Hi everybody, this is Steve, and welcome back to Artificer. Alright, hopefully I'm not blowing out the microphone here, or the, your speakers. Um, I've been messing with my microphone settings because I feel like uh, my last couple of videos have been far too quiet. So, this is uh, going to be experiment with some uh, new settings. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alrighty then, so we are back at it. Um, and I realized I overlooked some important uh, beginning tips and stuff as the game started up last time. Um, we are told to find a part of the ship to the southeast. So while I'm working on the new stuff that I can uh, craft... Sick. Oh, sorry. Sometimes that doesn't load in right when you first launch it. Um, so yeah, while I'm working on this stuff, I gotta find clay for that. Um, don't need another research desk. Uh, glass flask. I don't know why it's a cube for now. That's probably something they're gonna update in the future. Charcoal. I can make charcoal, I believe. I think that's later on in here. Oh, I gotta make the, um... I can make that right now. Boom. We have us a fireplace. Oh, I do have clay. I was just looking in there, not what's on my bar. Let's put everything up here. Uh, I think what would be a really cool system to add into the game <clears throat> would be a way to auto-sort this. I know that's something that exists in a lot of other games. I've actually been playing a lot of Seven Days to Die with my wife recently. And uh, we're trying to figure out a way to record both of us playing um, and put them up here for you guys because that game is just a lot of fun. <clears throat> but it has a system like that, so that's what got me thinking about it. Um, go ahead and put this out. I'm not planning on going to the southeast just this very second. I want to start that way. Uh, I want to do it in all in one video, though, because I don't know how far I'm going to have to go. <clears throat> Excuse me. We'll um, explore a little of the southeast. Okay, so... I know I can... item in that slot will burn, and results. Oh, okay, so I probably have to put... Aha! I was hoping I could do something like that. And, okay, it actually it has some systems very similar to Seven Days to Die. And I um, <laughs> wish I'd thought to check these before. If you right-click and drag, you take half the stack. If you have the whole stack and right-click, you deposit one really good system there. So if I put that in, that in, okay, I had to put a couple in apparently. Boom, I now have charcoal. Then it immediately stops. That's awesome. Okay, how much, um, not that one, this one, did I need for the torch? I need a second one. I have the weeping agaric, and I have a branch. So I could make a torch, which would be awesome right now. <clears throat> Excuse me, I just need to make another charcoal. Put two. Boom. Um, and let's make that. Awesome. Okay, so I right click. <clears throat> I don't know if this ever runs out. Oh, and I don't even have to, I don't even have to stay actively on it. <clears throat> Sorry, I can't keep uh, my throat clear there. I want to, real quick, just out of curiosity's sake. Okay, awesome. I want to make that standing torch, if I have enough material for it. I may have to uh, go get... Um... Oh, good. Yeah, I'm going to have to get another log, but that's easily done. So, um, craft the other torch. Put that in here. I'm going to come up here, chop down one of these trees. Oh, good. I was actually having audio problems with the game running correct. Ah, shoot. Didn't see it because I was looking off screen. I am. I got to find a way to heal my character. Otherwise, I'm going to be starting this over. And that will be... I mean, fine for you guys, because I'll cut every... Or, or I'll just get back to kind of this point before I start playing again. Craft. 
Awesome. Go ahead and play. How about there? Awesome. Standing torch. <laughs> uh, I do actually like the crafting system in here. At first it was a little confusing, but it actually follows a lot of the same principles of uh, some other games and stuff I've played. So it was only confusing because of it, that being my own fault. Okay, so next is the kiln. I need more clay, and that's it. I just need more clay, and I actually know where to get that. So I think I'm going to go ahead and go right now and get that. That is this way. Um, again, kind of to the southeast, so I'm making progress to where I want to get to anyways. But it's more east than southeast. Should be a pond that I found in the last video. Why you were lagging a little there. Oh, shoot. I don't want to fight you. Okay. This is the clay right here. Go ahead and mine this. Just needed a couple pieces. But I'm going to go ahead and break up this whole stack. There we go. Because you never know when you need extra. I do not want to fight those guys right now if I do not have to. Okay. So once the next day starts, uh, that is my plan to go to the southeast. I actually finally found a use for this stuff. I wonder if I can... I should, uh, I should actually... Oh, no worms. Centipedes. I only know centipede because it says you get the... It calls it centipede poison or something like that. Okay, some more sticks, some more wood. I need all this stuff. Um, nope, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. I want to experiment real quick, which is why I got the more wood. Throw some more, uh, more stuff in there. I want to see... Okay, nope, nothing. Uh, if I can burn any of this other stuff, and if I'll get any other kind of output. Well, so far, nothing. How about the clay? Like, suddenly get a pot? No, oh, okay. I'm gonna take half that stack back. Um... Oh, I didn't check the, these weeping agarics. Weeping agaric, luminar, whalewood log, mush cane, dotted algae, stone, whalewood branches, snakeweed, how did I get snake wheat? Oh yeah, I can pick those up, but they they damage me. I have sand and clay. Ooh. No, not here. Uh oh wait, I think glass was Oh no, I got it. Okay, so I make the kiln and then I can probably make the glass in there from the sand and make the glass flasks. Okay. Getting ahead of myself. Go ahead and craft that. Inventory so I can get out of there. And yeah, we'll put this on the other side of the torch. Okay, so this is gonna... I'm gonna have to go gather a bunch of wood. Um, okay, so I only needed one to get of the clay to get an output. What is that gonna give me? A brick. Two bricks, actually. Nice. How about the sand? Another one in there, so I can... I'll go ahead and make a flask, so I can check that out. Definitely need more wood. Um, and I doubt... Wow, that brick takes up a lot of space. Yeah, I doubted it, but curiosity got the best of me. Okay, making lots of good stuff. Probably about to get more research points, but I don't know what to... I don't, I don't have any new research to work on. Um, as far as I know, in the alpha here... There's um, no additional uh, 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 stuff yet beyond this, as far as I know. But I'm figuring this out with you guys as I go. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait a second. Uh, four points. These reset. I guess. Uh, I guess there's more stuff for me to unlock. Moon, 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 mountain. Mountain was up there. 
Uh, I haven't found another mountain. Oh, got lucky there. And I just received 10 points. Okay, another mountain, mountain skull. Light? Nope, that was a moon. Mountain, oh shoot. Dang it, it was right there. Ray of light, oh crap. There? Dang it, skull. At least I know where the skulls are. Ray of light, ray of light. Moon. Yes. Skull. Oh, crap. I got a 50-50 chance here. Ah, uh, I'm going to have to wait one more day to finish clearing this. I don't know what new stuff it's going to give me or if it's just going to be the same stuff as before. I'm fine with the... Oh, my torch ran out. So that does run out after a while. wonder when it ran out. I'll look back at this later and be like, oh, and I wonder if the standing one ever runs out. Huh. Anyways, I know I need more wood, so I'm going to chop down another one of these trees. Hopefully we don't run into a centipede. Because I can't take many more hits. Yeah, I don't even know what I can do with the flask. I might be able to pick up water. I want to stop over there, and then I'm going to head more south and see what I can find. Okay. Put in there. I should see what I can do with the bricks, because they are huge. I can tell nothing. Uh-huh. Uh Let me jump in. Okay, so kiln. I can make the glass. Charcoal. Oh, I can make paper in the kiln from the mush cane pulp, which paper is important for a couple things. Okay, charcoal, fireplace, standing torch. So that was it. That was it of the new stuff. So other than the paper, which I'll make real quick just for kicks and giggles, punches and laughs. <laughs> I actually prefer saying punches and laughs. Uh, I must need more wood, is my guess. Wasn't it the mush cane? Hmm. Okay, hold on here. Fibrous pulps. Mush cane. Oh, for mush cane pulp. I have just mush cane. How do I make mush cane pulp? the fire no. missing something missing maybe something potentially obvious hmm. do not know Maybe the ship will give me something different. All this stuff is smaller, but that just might be my imagination right now. Oh well. Alright. I'm actually not too worried about going out in the dark here. I know where I'm going. I don't really need the paper for anything or else, in it, or else uh, anything else right now, because you just need the paper for making the research station, and I think the basic workshop. And I don't plan on needing any more of those right now. Any more stone? I don't know why I'm doing that. Pick up some more clay, but then I want to see if I can fill up the flasks with water while I'm here. Just because curiosity. Excuse me, and then we're going to head more south. Lots of clay. All right. Okay. Any of the buttons I know of for how to do things. I spam all the buttons. Um. So no, I can't fill up the flasks. Okay. So.
rocks and more clay. I didn't even notice this water before, so happy to find that. Just more stone. Yeah. Those. Oh, it was put them down here. Shows them going into the bag, even if you have it actively on your bo uh, bar. So that throws me off sometimes. Okay. Don't need any of those flowers. Not seeing anything trying to kill me. Downed log. Trees. Still need a knife, too. It hints that you can have a knife. But I have not made one. Oh, hello. There's some kind of enemy. Just gonna avoid you for now. Alright, I don't know how far south I'm gonna go. Parcel of water. Oh, shoot. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. So far, they're missing me. So, and the angle is working out for my benefit. Okay, they're running away. Ow! Ow! I'm totally dead. I am so totally dead. Healing. You can heal. That is not fair. Okay, I'm. <laughs> I know that was kind of monotone. Ah, uh, no, it's because I was focused on the game, looking around. Oh man, that was close. I cannot fight anything else. I I wish I knew how to heal myself. I feel like I'm overlooking something, something that I can do in the game. Empty-handed, and I interact with the water. I feel like the water is going to be important eventually. I wish I could figure out how to turn that into paper. Again, I'm probably just overlooking something obvious, like a, a button I'm not thinking of. I'll look in between. I want to take this video a little bit longer. Uh, was this the one? Yeah, this is where I want to head back west. I think. We'll find out soon enough. Hello, trees. Yeah, should be just over here. Kind of notice I just leave the mouse in the middle and I mostly use the short keys. Ah, I made it back alive. I'm hoping with the research just unlocks something I'm missing. My wood's gone. In the fireplace. Hmm. All right. Um, how do I get How do I get mush pulp? Almost done with that level of research. Want to make paper? Maybe there's something in here I'm overlooking that tells me about it. Nope. Because, yeah, so I need the paper for the research desk. And that's really it. But, I mean, just knowing the fact that I can now craft paper, but I don't know how to make the ingredient before the crafting of the paper, that is a little annoying. Let's see here. Yeah, it just rearranges. Oh well, what the? Getting double stacks of stuff. Don't even know how I did that. I am very hurt. Not certain. Uh, I wonder if the torch would have helped me scare the end those creatures and stuff away during the day. So I may. Um, So I'm going to make another torch just to have on me for the next night time. And then we will go attack the night time again. This time having a torch on hand, ready to scare off those creatures. And 
maybe I can figure out a way to heal in the meantime. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, actually. Oh no, that was so difficult. Heat treatment research complete. I already had the heat treatment research completed. Okay, well, let's see if there's any new recipes and stuff in here. No, nope. Literally, literally gave me nothing new. I, I already had all that unlocked. Must have been a little glitch in the game. All good in the hood. Roger's neighborhood. All right, so I'm going to do some messing around. I'm not going to make any real progress in between now and the next video because I, I do want to do one more and see if I can make it farther southeast. And if I die, I die. I think I've, uh, uh, other than finding the part that it's telling you about, which I'm not even 100% certain if it's in here or not, but I'm actually, I'm fairly certain there's a lot of stuff in this game that I have yet to find. Um... And especially at this, uh, this is a later alpha build, lo uh, a late early access, something like that. So again, I'm sure I'm just missing stuff, but uh, I'm going to leave this one here for now. I hope you guys have been enjoying it. Uh, I know I definitely have. Um, so yeah, usual, like, subscribe, leave me some feedback. I do want to hear from you guys. Uh, definitely, please give me some feedback what you're thinking about this game because uh, that's going to help the developers on this one. They're still looking for some feedback. They still want to know what everybody's thinking about. So uh, leaving me feedback, um, potentially we'll get to them. I realize how big-headed that made me myself sound? Eh, whatever. Uh, <laughs> uh, but again, I'll leave all the information as well down in the description uh, for these guys. Uh, Silo Libe. I never say like I never feel like I'm saying that right. Um, but I'll leave some links down to their information so you can go check out their uh, Balthazar's Dream. Uh, check out those videos on my channel as well. Uh, oh, I think I only did one or two. I can't remember now, but it was almost a year ago uh, when I did those videos for them. Um, but that's another game I want to return to. These guys make some pretty good games, and that story was really interesting for Balthazar's Dream. Um, so yeah, I feel like I rambled on enough. Um, uh, again, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you later!